All right, what's going on dudes and welcome back to Hexit where we're gonna tinker with some construct and stuff and things I've set up the command block that'll take us to and from the smelting area pretty quickly And I'm also in the middle of getting some more food and I've smelted a bunch of gold so that hopefully we can create the casts and stuff that we need to smelt the mana Into the tools that we want to make or the rapier. I think we're gonna make a rapier first so in the meantime well, the food is cooking and also I actually need to smelt the gravel so let me make that I think that this is the crafting recipe right boom and that'll get us or grout I should say oh wait it was two grout per oh I got way more than I needed to oops I should have paid more attention to the crafting recipe my bad well anyway we got our two stacks of grout and let me go ahead and I have my coal in my inventory um, I'll wait for that to finish up and then we can get some mega grout smelting going since we don't actually need that much I'll just split this into four different uh, furnaces 16 each and we'll get a, a stack so cool wait for this one to go actually let me start setting up so split you into four boom and two coal per actually I need to nope we're good there throw you in and two and throw you in and one two and throw you in and one two and that should get us a stack pretty quickly in the meantime i need to make some uh some stuff for making like the the tool things and whatnot so let me actually reference the uh the material guide book thing i'm a new hicker because i don't need to do that in order to make the um so i need to make a stencil table i think i need to make a part crafter a pattern chest I need to make all these things actually so I will need actually the the full stack of grout is probably a worthwhile investment so anyway uh, let's begin with the stencil table which we actually have I think I think we have okay we have the stencil table we have the tool station um, so we need the uh, part crafter pattern chest and tool forge Part crafter is crafted like so, so blank stencil. Do we have one of those? No, we need to make one. So what's the recipe for a blank stencil? It is just two pieces of wood and two sticks. Okay, so we definitely have that. Two pieces of wood and where did I put the sticks? Must have put them over here. Let me just grab a bunch more actually while I'm at it. There we go. So we need to craft that really quickly. Boom. Okay, like so. Oh, I could have done it in my head. Not a big deal. Okay, so blank pattern, and then it was on top of a... Oh, darn it. Need to go and fetch a solid piece of wood, like that. And then we should be able to craft this in my head. Boom. Okay, part builder. And then the final one was what? Um, okay, so that good. Oh, we also need to make another one. Okay, so let me do that really quickly. Do I have enough? I do indeed. Boom, and then I need a chest. So let me make another chest. Actually, I think I have an extra one, don't I? No, I don't. Okay, well, not a big deal. And another chest, boom, 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 and boom. Okay, pattern chest, and finally we need the tool forge. So that's gonna require a lot of iron, and we also need to make another tool station, okay? So we need to make another thing of a doohicker like so. And we need to get another piece of wood really quickly. Actually, no. What, what was the crafting recipe again? Sorry. I'm great at remembering these things, I know. Um, so we need a, where's the tool station? We need a, a workbench. Okay. So I think I have an extra one of those laying around somewhere, right? Right. Yes, I do. Okay, cool. So boom and boom. Everything is just a, it's, oh wait. Whoa. If I just put a crafting table in the work, if I put a crafting table in the crafting table, it gives me another crafting station. Oh man, fancy. Anyway, I need a tool station. So that's two of them. And then what was the last thing that I needed to do is a tool forge using, okay, so seared bricks. Seared bricks, good. We're all done with the smelting. Beautiful. Give me all those levels. And okay, so now we can make more seared bricks, which we need to do. How do I, oh, look at all these seared things that I can make. <laughs> Um, so that's just four of them. So I need to make three of those. Boom, 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 three. And then, where, wait. Where'd my seared bricks go? I, they disappeared. Why'd my seared bricks disappear? What the heck? Oh, what? No, it, 
It gave me another, it gave me another, converted automatically my stuff into a smell. God dang it. Why did it do that? Why did it do that? Well, well hold on. Is it going to give me useful information? Mighty smelting. Um. Oh, so I don't actually, oh, I only need one layer? Oh, okay. Well, then I actually, I have plenty of seared bricks. So, never mind. I don't know why I just, I don't know why I did that. I shouldn't have done that. Oh, well. Oops, I could have used them from the, uh, the furnace. I was watching the, the tutorial. And they had the setup as I had sort of uh, made it into at the village. Anyway, all right. So we need to make the what's it called? We need to make the seared tank. No, we have, we have the seared tank, or do we have the seared tank? I don't think we have the seared tank. So we need to make that, and we also need to make the faucet. And so let's do that really quickly. Faucet should be easy enough. Boom. Okay, faucet, and then we needed to make a, a drain, whatever it's called, drain, or we need to make the, yeah, we need to make two drains, so that is like that and like that, two, they gave me one, why did you give me one drain and not two? Oh, because I, haha, I need to do it twice, haha, I know what I'm doing. Okay, we need two of those, and then we also need, no, I think that's it, we need one more faucet, actually, should be good, and then... We need a smeltery basin thing. One sec. Let's see if that's correct. Um, yeah, casting basin, and that's made like so. Okay, and that should be everything that we need. Boom. All our resources are in check, and then I want to bring that, and I want to bring a stick with me, and then what else do I want to bring? I'm going to have to figure out how to craft a crossbar, because I think that's the final piece of the puzzle that I need. So, hold on, let's see how we make a rapier. It is sword blade, tool rod, and crossbar, so I have to figure out how to make a crossbar, um, because that stuff is not listed in not enough items. So, anyway, okay, back to the smeltery. I labeled all the, the teleports now, so that should help us out. So, anyway, um, well, no point in destroying the, the blocks up here. Oh, I actually had a basin. Oops, didn't need to make that. Um, so what do I, what do I need to make now? I just need to replace... Uh, replace these blocks. Okay, replace you and replace. I actually only need one, so that'll be the drain. Boom, right there. And so we need to put two of these down. Beautiful. And also the faucet. So the faucet will drain into there. And then we also, over on this side, want to use that. Okay, cool. I don't know why it just gave me another. Oh. Why is it replacing stuff in my inventory as I go? That's really weird. All right, so what we need to do is we need to get some lava. So I have my bucket in my backpack, and I need to put that in here. Cool. Um, and then I need to go and fill it up with some lava. So what's the best approach? Just grab some from right there. Cool. And fill up this thing with some lava, I think. Oh wait, we did need to make this smeltery drain thing. Whoops. Somewhere around here is bound to have a, a workbench, right? I need to make the controller and the drain. All right, well, anyway, let me just run back. Got our easy teleportation system. Boom, okay, so I need to make the uh, controller and seared, so let's search for seared. Seared tank, so we need a piece of glass. Do we have a piece of glass? I don't think we do. So let me just go ahead and smelt a piece of sand really quickly. I know I have some sand over in here. Boom, sand, awesome, cool. Throw you in there, get a piece of glass in return. Not use a full piece of coal. And let me eat some steak, because I'm hungry. Okay, so that, and then we also needed the uh, smeltery controller. What's it called? controller that is what it's called and that is just crafted like so okay cool boom smeltery controller and finish yourself up give me a piece of glass in return and there we go okay now we should have all the parts we need sorry for that delay boom good cool let's run on back and get this smelting going so okay here we go let me destroy these two at the front and now all I have to do is put the, yeah, hey, hey, armadillo, watch out. 
we're doing science here. So that goes there, that goes there, and then I do that, and it's sort of filled up, and now I get more lava. I, okay, I, I guess I'm possibly gonna need to get some more lava, um, like more than, than what is here. So, okie dokie then. Let's see, I don't know, maybe it'll work. Oh God, ow, why'd you do that? Oh, why'd you do that? Oh God, don't do that. Ow, <laughs> that's not nice. Are we, are we good? Ow, stop, ow, stop, ow. Hold on. Okay, apparently, apparently, apparently we're good. Okay, jeez, god dang it. I thought that, I thought I had to click it many times to get it to fill up. Anyway, maybe, maybe we're good. Maybe we're fine. Maybe we're fine. Maybe it'll just take a little longer since it's not totally filled up. Anyway, that was painful. Ouch. <laughs> so now we want to throw our gold in. And uh, it should melt it. And then, hey, you're watching? Are you watching other super duper smelting stuff going on? And so as the bar fills up, when it reaches the top, it should turn into liquid. And then what we need to do is we need to cast some stuff. Um, in the meantime, let me, uh, can, oh god, can you not do that? Can you not do that? Can you just go away, Lava? Oh my god, stop it right now. Please, 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 please go away. Please go away. Please, you have no source blocks, so you should not be here. Okay, thank you. So look, our gold is liquid, and it's amazing, and we have nine molten gold ingots, so now what we can do is we can, so we need a, a sword blade, part of the rapier, so we put that there, and then we right click, oh man, it's filling up, it's filling up, and then it's gonna harden, and then, uh, there we go. Now we have a sword blade cast, which, so basically, the, the wooden tool thingamadoo hicker, um, the wooden pattern, that doesn't work for like ingots, like manoleum and iron and so on and so forth. So you need to make a gold cast in order to do that. And then why is there a bird? A mercenary controller? I'm very interested in what this is. <laughs> Getting sidetracked, by the way. Anyway, so we, need, we have the sword blade. Now we need to do it with a stick, I think. So put the stick in there and we'll cast this. Did I use up all my, use everything? God dang it, I used everything up. All right, I don't have enough to, to at least cover something new. So, hold on, go ahead and, and, and let's see. Oh, we've set, wait, no, I should have had enough. I shouldn't have had to throw in more gold there. Whatever, we can drain it out and it'll fill this up and then we can mine it out when it reaches a solid block. So, any hoosers, go ahead and, and smelt yourselves. Come on, give me nine, one more, and liquidify. 16, okay, please work. Why are you not working? Why you no work? Do I have to click you with a bare hand? What did I do the friggin' thing with? Um, maybe it wasn't a stick. What did I use? I used something to get the thing. Um, rod. Oh, wait. Oh, I needed a rod. It wasn't a st How do I make a rod? Um, it, wait. How do I, how do I make a rod? How did I do that? Do I put a stick in the inventory and, and give me a rod? No. Hold on, because I need a rod, not a stick. And I need to figure, maybe, maybe we'll figure it out if we put down all these different things that we need to put down in order to actually successfully do this, which is a lot of things. Um, and then where is the, oh, we didn't make the, the tool forge thing. So let me run and do that really quickly. That was tool forge, tool forge, boom, boom, boom. And three on top and a bunch of iron. Nice, let's use up basically all of our iron. Not quite all of it, but you know. Okay, so there we go. One and two, four pieces. And then it goes like that. Boom, seared bricks on top and a tool station in there. Cool, we have a tool forge. So that's all five things we need. That's a lot of things that we needed to, to make in order to, to do this stuff. All right, cool, good, good. Now, we head back there and we'll lay out all this stuff, I don't know, right down here. So boom, and boom, and why is it rearranging my inventory as I place things down? That's really weird. Okay, so look at all these different stations that we need. <laughs> so stencil table. Um, if I put in perhaps a blank pattern there, will it allow me to tool station and tool forge? So let me put down a, put down a stick. Nope. Next pattern, previous pattern. Hmm. You need to go back and fetch a pattern 
and see how it can you can you move can you move away can you move can you guys like can you move away It'd be really really convenient if you could if you could move away can you move away no you can't can you move away It'd be nice thanks thanks man thanks thanks okay can you move away now can you can you move thanks okay what a great guy all right cool what a nice guy so let me grab a an existing pattern i just don't know which thing to use which and there are so many different parts and and tinkering and, and constructing and let me make a blank pattern and we'll see how we do this so let me i didn't make a blank pattern i just exited the the crafting before even grabbing it nice job all right so now let's try this okay so if we put this in everyone just wants to see what we're doing it's really pretty nice next okay so we can craft this into whatever we need so all we need to do hey crossbar boom thank you and then after that okay we'll just get a tool rod will be great it will be fantastic that's actually really really easy to do so I didn't need to go back for that um, I could have just made it in my head over there oh well not a big deal boom boom get another blank pattern and we'll craft that into a tool rod all right so that's pretty simple boom and next pattern tool rod tool rod where are you where are you keep on scrolling what is this? what is, oh, a large plate i thought it was like a creeper face or something it is a creeper face but i thought maybe you could make a creeper face weapon all right come on no 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 no, no. there's no tool rod how do I make a friggin' tool rod? Oh my god. Do I, what, what do I, I don't know what the pattern chest does either. How do I make a tool rod? I do not know. I can do, I can put that in there, right? Yeah, I can put that in there. I just don't know how I make a tool, how do I make a, that's what I need, is I need a tool rod. It's not letting me do it. I need a tool rod for everything. Hold on, I'm just gonna look it up on the wiki really quickly, and I shall be right back. Oh, hey, look, a tool rod's really easy to make. You just put two cobblestone on top of each other. Okay, cool. Nice. Nice. I should have should have noticed that. Why is everyone coming out to watch me? Isn't that interesting? Oh, my God. I'm getting away from you guys for a second. Oh, yay. So, cobblestone tool rod is exceedingly easy to make. Boom. Done. All right. Tough stuff. We're back now. <laughs> nice. All right, head back to the smeltery, and hey, it's a crowd. Everyone's still watching. I don't know why you guys are doing that. So let's go ahead and put you in there, and now smelt it up. All right, cool. Yeah, see, it wouldn't make sense to use a stick as a, a casting thing because I feel like a stick would kind of just burn with molten stuff being poured over it, which makes sense. Anyway, okay, so now... We can finally throw the crossbar into... See, we get all different ways of making this. One is made in the crafting table, one we already had, and one we have to actually go into the part builder and put uh, a piece of gold in... Or no, a piece, of, a piece of cobblestone in. Boom. And we need a stone crossbar. Cool. And now we can throw the crossbar into here, just like we've been doing. Boom. Cast it. Yeah, you're watching. You're watching because it's really interesting. I know all you guys are like, holy crap, what's he doing with the furnace? We've never used it before. So this is really, really interesting. It's the most interesting thing that's happened this all week. Okay, so now, now that we have this all, all good to go, so ingots 12 crap. Um, I really, I kind of overdid it. So I'm going to have some leftover, which uh, is unfortunate. Oh, well, so let's drain it out. And then I'm going to go and get the, the man, manual, man, 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 I don't know how to pronounce it. I need to dump out my inventory of all this excess stuff. Let me put in all the like excess pattern thing, thingamadoo hickers in here. Um, all the sword blade and patterns and, and crossbars and things and, and the things that we might not need. Can put the extra grout and gravel back in here. Let me just arrange this really quickly in a quick, quick manner. Um, put our seared bricks back in there. And, okay, cool. So now we've got a little bit of extra space in our inventory. And I can fetch the minimum win. Okay, so let me grab this. And we have 10. Is that going to be enough, actually? I hope it's going to be enough, because if it's not enough, I'm going to be sad. What's the cost? Uh, point, oh, it's 0.5. Oh, that's really easy. So we definitely have enough. 
Um, yeah, we have like way, way enough. So we're gonna be able to make a manimo manimo wind rapier. Yeah, I'm happy. Uh, did you drain everything out? No, no. Oh, do I have to hit some more drainage? Keep draining, keep draining. We need to make a solid block out of this so I can mine it. Gimme, gimme that and wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. There we go. Nope, don't, don't do that, don't do that. Don't mind the, mind the, stop it. No, stop, stop it, stop it. I just, stop it, hold on. Can it, no, oh my goodness, this is obnoxious. Is it gonna, okay, it gave me the gold at least. Anyway, um, now let's put this back. Being lame, and we have our faucet as well. So we didn't lose anything in that transaction. Cool, boom, and boom. All right, nifty stuff, nifty stuff. So, what do you, that's gonna not turn out well for you. I'm sorry to like tell you that. And let's drain out the rest. So how much, okay, it's all gone. So now, now we throw in the mana moment. And now it's all purple, and ooh, it's glowing and stuff and fancy and things. And now we wait for that. I think it takes a little bit longer because manual, Manny, Manny Ulin, Manny Ulin, it takes a little bit longer. So all we're gonna need to do is put these in the in the the thingamadoo hicker, right? And then we'll pour the stuff over it, and it's gonna be great. We just have to wait. It's gonna be great. We just have to wait. It's a rhyme. You hear that this time? D rhyming on a dime and I don't have a lime for my drink so I'm just gonna sit here and think while people are hammering overhead in their sink and yee okay I'm just waiting just doing things to to pass time while I'm waiting for it to smelt and then we'll have a rapier oh so in the meantime let me actually show you some cool stuff what we can do is after we actually have a rapier we can do all these modifications to it with other other recipes and stuff and or other other modifying materials. So like we can put diamond and it'll make it more durable. We can put emerald and it'll make it mine more, which doesn't apply to a rapier, but in case we wanted to make a pickaxe or something, what did I want? Oh, auto repair is kind of cool. You can use a uh, moss. This is why I wanted to get the mossy cobblestone is because you can make that moss clump with like nine mossy cobblestone. Um, what I did want, so you can also do auto smelt like the dragon's blood vial thingamadoo hicker that we've done in the past. Anyway, okay. Oh yeah, there's a ball of moss and, and lava crystal and stuff. So, what were the ones that I wanted? Oh yes, I wanted to get some uh, <clears throat> some quartz because that actually is good for, for weapons. I also wanted to get some blaze powder because that's good too. So we're gonna have to go to the nether for some stuff. I don't even know how you get the bone of a wither skeleton, um, but what does it do? It, uh, oh, it does lifesteal. Yeah, it's, we want some lifesteal. And how do we actually make a bone of a wither skeleton? And it's all smelted, so one sec. Let me figure this out really quickly. Necrotic bone, is that it? Um, does it just randomly drop from... Hey, 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 zombie, 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 zombies. Calm it down. Calm it down, guys, okay? No one's watching anymore because they're all scared of the zombies. Oh, well. Makes it less busy out here for me. So, now that we have our manulin, boom. Make a cast, boom, wait for it to harden, and boom, tool rod, boom. Lots of booms going on right now, boom. Wait for it to fill, and boom. And now we have a crossbar, and then sword blade cast, and boom, and wait for it to fill, and boom. See, now we have all the rapier parts, and it's amazing. So now what we can do is we can go into the, uh, is it the tool forge? I think, select the rapier, boom, boom, boom. We've got a man, Manny Lynn rapier, and it's the best already. I don't know how much damage it's gonna do. For some reason, I doubt it's gonna be as, whoa, it's all like pointed weird. How do I look with this? I look like I'm carrying some sort of very strange miniature bazooka in my arm. <laughs> That's my rapier, guys. It's pretty cool. Uh, so how much damage, do we even, oh, there's a spider. All right, guinea pig, spider, and skeleton, how much damage? How much damage? It's armor piercing, which is the uh, the benefit of this stuff. Um, it doesn't do much damage, only four, crap. I thought it would be a little bit better than that. Even if it's not doing 20, I thought maybe it'd do like nine or seven or something before. Looks like we've got some uh, maybe enchanting to do or maybe we put on the, the stuff that'll uh, make it do more. Stop it, stop it, zombie, stop, 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 stop. Oh, it can do a lot of hits though. I didn't realize, like, did you see that? Did you see how many hits it did? That was gnarly. It was just like boom, 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 boom. You're done -zo. And how much, do I don't really want to waste my manulin, so. I'm gonna leave it there 
for future possible like if we run out of this rapier we can make another rapier um or we can do other stuff but i don't want to waste my man many minimum -min -min. okay so we've got that uh this is inefficient because now we just have like remnants left over crap and i can't drain it either unless i waste my gold that's not even a big deal if i waste my gold though so all right we can also make more drains if we need to i realize because we have an extra so with that being said and done and stuff, I suppose we should go into the nether and we should get some quartz and we should get some blaze. Do we have blaze? I don't know if we actually have blaze. Hold on. Do we have the blaze? Do we have the blaze powder? Uh, oh, we do have some blaze rods, so we do have blaze powder. Well, let's go ahead and add that while we can. We'll see how that works. Just as a, I don't know, cool thing. I don't know if I... Uh, uh, we're, yeah, it doesn't matter if I use my blaze powder. I'm not like waiting on it for anything else. So let's quickly turn it into blaze powder. And where do I do this once again? It's in the tool forge, right? So yeah, I can put the blaze powder in here, put the rapier in here. Oh my God, it looks fancy. Oh, look at that. Um, that's really, really gnarly. Look at that. It's super cool. Um, I didn't realize it changes the appearance. That's awesome. Okay, so anyway, we grab that, but then we can do it more times, right? Yeah, oh, we keep cycling it. Oh, we keep cycling it, keep cycling it. Yeah, the hammering doesn't stop, the hammering don't stop, and boom. So, good to go. And now, I think that, what does the blaze do again? Let me look at, no, I'm gonna have to take him out first. Stop. Oh, it makes lights go on fire. Ha ha, I get wrecked, son. Okay. So that's cool. Now, uh, I guess we'll call it there for this episode. Thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed, a rating would be much appreciated. Next time, we'll venture on into the nether, and we'll try to find some uh, some quartz so we can keep improving this thing, and then uh, maybe try to find... I guess we should try to find wither skeletons as well. That way we can get the necrotic bone or what have you, and get lifesteal and stuff. It'd be awesome. All right, I'll see you then.